Alexander Lepershinsky, better known to his athletes as Sasha, was once a highly ranked fencer in the former Soviet Union. People call uh, fencing um, physical chess. In 2016, he was Panama's Olympic fencing coach. All of his athletes must learn a certain skill regardless of their age. And only one thing helps you, it's your mental condition. So if you're ready to fight, if you're able to control yourself completely, if you're able to keep your attention during the whole tournament, you're going to be winner. Sasha has established one of the top national fencing schools in the country. It's in Hollywood, and he's produced several nationally ranked competitors. Atari Greenbaum from Davey is the current U-17 national champion. At times, she has to explain that her sport isn't like some pirate movie or even something silly. People will like pick up a fork or something and be like, let's fence. And I'm like, mm, it's not really like that. So I kind of have to explain to them, it doesn't really work like that. You can't just pick up a fork and try to hit each other. 15-year-old Grant Dotrill of Boca Raton recently won the bronze medal at the North American Cup. His approach in a match is simple. I get sort of like fired up in it. And so sometimes I have to calm myself down because I'll just get all jumpy, but it just... You just want to stab someone? Basically. In competition, there are three three-minute matches. The first to score 15 points wins. The waist up is your target. A touch is a point. To fully understand it, I battled Sasha on guard. 